couldn't I didn't really try to go attack, but and as all of you know, I cast Fairy Fire on him, which gives me the ability to see his troops, and so therefore I can see the surroundings. So if I switch to what I can see in Fog of War, so now uh, you can see I can't see anything that I can't see, but you can see he's got this Fairy Fire, so I can see everything he's doing in his base. Which I didn't even know about. Yep, so now I can see everything he's doing. I guess that's what that thing above their head means. Yeah, it's Fairy Fire. See right here. And it's attacking again. I think I focus on this hero. Yeah, focus on my hero and I gotta run out. And I should have used my potion, but I forgot I had it. And so now I'm about to I think I'm about to use it. And finally I got my tree of life up and it's finally building and I got this one already filled up too. He's got two people did you, did, why'd you not, oh you eventually attacked this, don't you? Yeah, but they get killed but I think they were already low health like come creeping. So, I pretty much just keep running in and out trying to micromanage here. And so he's my nuke again, surrounded this time. I don't want him to get out. And he's out. Got a level 4 hero, level 3. Keeper of the Grove. I think my hero's about to die right here. He's got that. Yep, focus fire. And so, a spare fire is doing a lot of. Help him out a whole lot, but he's holding his own right now, definitely. Uh, concentration fire is killing me. And now he gets out of night. So now I'm down to hardly any troops. So I had to back out right there. I'm actually going to entangle him and focus fire on him so I can get him out of the way. But I think I ended up letting him go. Your building is complete. Does it kill you? And the entanglement kills him. <laughs> How sad. Our yes, sacred that's... grove is now being desecrated. I'm actually going to make my uh, warden back. You can see he's got two footmen attacking my uh, tree of life. My tree of life should have no problem killing him. So, I'm just, I was never really worried about that. So now I'm making more uh, more Druid of the Talons, and, and now I'm making Druid of the Claw. I'm the getting ready to make bears because I'm away. sick of having to deal with uh, the Rifleman. So. And he actually comes up here to come attack my base now. And so when I see that, because I can see him with the Fairy Fire, so I'm going to come in here and start messing with his base to back him off my base. And then when he notices his base is getting hurt, he runs in, so then I notice he's running in, so I get back out. I was just trying to get him out of uh, trying to get him off my base. So that fairy fire messed me up, I guess. Cause uh, I saw you run in there and then right when I came back you <laughs> ran back out and I was like, How in the world did you know I was coming back already? Well now you know. You got sight and every day and now you can see I'm uh, starting to get Drew to the Claw uh, upgrades so I can get my bears. For the Drew to the town for the Drew to the Claw, you have to get uh, You'd have Tree of Eternity to get bears, so I have to get two upgrades. So that's my first one. It gives him re the rejuvenation ability, so I can heal my troops with him. And then I'm about to get another one. Research finished. You'll see it come up in a second. For the for the bears, and there it is, the master training. Gotcha. So you now I got rejuvenation, but I don't ever use it. I forgot I even had it. So my hero should be up any time. At this point, I think I already finished my gold mine. Like, my gold mine's gone, and I'm trying to find another one. He sure is. He's out of gold. Out of gold. And man. he has, let's see how much, he has only 179 gold. So you can see what happened there. I was unable to build any more units. He tried uh, to go up there. Uh, Seth didn't, I don't think he really, oh, he tried to go up to that gold mine. I don't think, I don't think he knew there was creeps there. Yeah. I'm so he tries to come after my gold mine because he needs one very, very bad. And um, if you didn't notice when I just looked at my base, I'm actually making chimeras and I'm making more bears. So, just to FYI. Are what are you doing right here? Oh, yeah, I got his worker. I think I pull all of my. I try and pull all of my guys over. 
try and pull all of my, uh, what are they called, the peasants, try and pull all of them over here after I destroy this base to get that gold mine to build another uh, town center. What Seth doesn't realize right here is that I'm actually getting my bears, uh, I got my bear upgrade now, so I'm, gonna, I'm actually going to block this off right here, so whenever he's done getting this base, I'm just actually going to, he's going to run into me no matter what. So now I got three bears, and you know how much damage they do with two upgrades on them. But he's actually going to pick apart my wisp. It took longer than I expected. And so now let's look at what Seth can see. Yep, he has he is unsuspecting right now. So he's over here, and I think he's going to start getting his peasants now. Yep, he's getting his peasants to go over there. And I think I run into his. And here comes his uh, his units right here. He's going to get his uh, riflemen all together and come down back down to his base to make sure I guess I don't attack him. Or are you messing around with this? I don't remember. Horses are under attack. So anyways, he brings his uh, people right there. He brings his peasants through and they're about to get annihilated. And so now here he comes. And I had my guys in the whole position in case he came. I didn't want to get pulled out. And so now I actually put Cyclone on four of his units with my Druid of Talon. And so it makes it a whole lot easier to kill off his units. And so now we gotta wait a few seconds to that Cyclone to wear off. I actually had five people. Now I got another bear, I got Treants to help out, and it's gonna be a piece of cake from here on out. Yeah, uh, that's about video. I think I'll quit here in a second. <laughs> Yeah, I got my uh, I got my Chimera up finally. Uh, where's it at? I finally got a Chimera up right here, and he wouldn't let me use it. What a yeah, jerk! I quit. He no, said there was no. no way I was gonna be able to do anything, so I just quit. He after said no. that. Yeah, I mean he had he had nothing. He had no gold mine or anything. I wanted to just use my Chimera, but he wouldn't let me. So that was that. It's kind of a um, new game but it was really fun we both had a good time he learned a little bit and it was awesome remember it was his first game so uh thanks for watching guys rate subscribe comment let us know what you like uh, if you have any videos that you want us to cast on uh just go ahead and uh email it to me at lineman1004 at aol.com i'll post that yeah we'll the, put that in the description also yep and we will cast it and just uh, tell us how we did, what we need to work on. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. See you soon.